but as a social worker, does do disabilities and poverty often go hand in hand? Oh, absolutely, absolutely. And you know, it's um, I'm very fortunate to um, be in the position that I'm in, where a lot of my education was completed, you know, prior to me losing my eyesight. Um, you know, I think that education is probably the hardest. Uh, thing to overcome as somebody who's blind or visually impaired because the people who are teaching the classes and and is as myself as a professor I can tell you, you know, you don't often know how to um, adapt your material for people who are um, blind or visually impaired. So it really is a, a learning curve for the colleges. It's a learning curve for, for the high schools. Um, and there's so few of the population that are currently in the public schools, um, you know, that have this, the, these visual disabilities. But if the educational system, especially higher education, would become more adaptive, uh, I think that we would have less poverty because more blind and vision impaired people would, would go further with their educations. You know, in the movie,